We know how important it is for a dog to explore their environment, but protecting them from danger is also vital. Animal Wise helps you do so with our list of 10 plants that can be fatal for your dog. Oleander. This is a shrub native to the Mediterranean basin, which is commonly found as an ornamental plant in parks and gardens. Despite its beauty, this plant is not only poisonous for dogs, but for people too. Its toxicity is due to the presence of cardiotoxic glycosides, compounds that produce serious cardiac disorders by affecting the sodium-potassium pump of the heart cells. Symptoms associated with oleander poisoning appear within a short period of time after ingestion. Specifically, we can observe vomiting, hypersalivation, muscle contractions, tachycardia, coma, and even death. Foxglove. As with oleander, this toxic plant for dogs induces cardioglycosidic toxicosis due to its content of cardiotoxic glycosides. The symptoms associated with this intoxication appear in a few hours and are the same as in the previous toxic plant. Golden Pothos Also known as Devil's Ivy, this plant has a high content of calcium oxalate which can cause irritation, pain, swelling of the mouth, hypersalivation, vomiting and difficulty swallowing. Swiss Cheese Plant this is a tropical climbing plant that has become a recent popular fixture in homes. As with apothos, it contains calcium oxalate that can cause intoxication characterized by the same symptoms. Some popular Christmas plants are also toxic to dogs. Discover them in the first info video above. Calla lily. As with apothos or the Swiss cheese, the calla lily contains high levels of calcium oxalate, which makes it a toxic plant for dogs. It's worth knowing that all parts of the calla are toxic, especially the flowers. The signs that can occur after ingestion of this plant are the same as in the two previous plants. Azalea. Known for their spring blooms, azaleas are common plants in many gardens, but are also highly toxic to dogs. All parts of the plant are poisonous, although the leaves are especially noxious. Azaleas contain andromedotoxin, a compound that produces cardiotoxicity by disrupting cardiac sodium potassium pumps. Signs begin six hours after ingestion. These include nausea, vomiting, anorexia, depression, weakness, incoordination, limb paralysis, cardiac depression, coma, and even death. Ivy. Although it is less dangerous than other plants mentioned above, it's also toxic to dogs. Its toxicity is due to the presence of heteroginin, a triterpenoid saponin capable of producing vomiting, diarrhea, abdominal pain, and hypersalivation. Does your dog like to eat grass? Find out the reasons for this behavior in our next info video. Aloe vera. You will probably be surprised to find it on this list since it's a plant that many people consider a natural panacea. In fact, the jelly-like sap of aloe leaves is toxic in sufficient amounts. This is because it contains saponins and anthraquinonines that can cause intoxication. Symptoms are vomiting, diarrhea, abdominal pain, hypersalivation, lethargy, and conjunctivitis. Dracaena. It's a very common ornamental plant in homes because it adapts very well to growing indoors. However, it's also toxic to your dog. The toxic compound of Dracaena is saponin, the ingestion of which produces symptoms such as vomiting, anorexia, hypersalivation, depression, and pupil dilation. Sago Palm or King Sago These small palm trees can often be found along the Mediterranean coastline and have seeds that are highly toxic to dogs. In fact, the ingestion of just one or two seeds can be fatal. The phytotoxin contained in the Sago Palm, known as cyacin, is hepatotoxic, its ingestion produces liver failure with coagulation disorders and death of the animal. The main clinical signs associated with this intoxication are vomiting, bloody diarrhea, yellowish mucous membranes, increased water consumption, bruising, and even death. If you want to continue learning about caring for dogs, don't miss the playlist we share here. Let us know how you protect your dogs against household dangers by sharing in the comments. We'll see you next time.